All right, so this is going to be how to connect Google Sheets to N8N. So I'm in my workflow here. I'm going to add a Google Sheets node. Now up here, it says credential to connect with. So this is where you're going to add your credential. I'm going to click create new credential. So this is the type of credential I need for my N8N. I am on a self-hosted cloud server with Hostinger. So what I want to do is go to the Google Cloud. So I'm in the Google Cloud here, and I want to create a new organization or new project. And I'm just going to hit Create. Once that's in, I'm going to select the project. And if I come down here to quick access, I'll click APIs and services. Now I want to go to enable APIs and services. And then I want to select Google Sheets. So now I want to enable Google Sheets API. Okay, so now that it is enabled, I can click on credentials. And now I want to create credentials. I think I need to configure it first though. So if I just click create credentials and I click on OAuth client ID, it'll take me here where I can click configure. Now I'll get started, app name, Name it whatever you want here. Put your email. You can do internal. I believe if you have a Google business email, you can do internal here. And then if you don't have a Google business email, you can do external. And then you'll just have to set your email as a developer account, I believe later. So I'm gonna do internal. I'm going to do your email there and then create. So now I want to create the OAuth here. It's going to be a web application. And then I need to add a authorized redirect URL. So that's where this comes in right here. So I copy this, add this URL, and then I hit create. That's going to give me my client ID, which I will copy and put here. And then also my client secret. I'm going to delete this afterwards, so it doesn't really matter that I'm giving out my secret. But you don't want to give anyone your secret. And then you can click sign in with Google. Select your account. And then you want to allow. Okay, so connection was successful. And now I can close out of this. And then I have my credential right here. I can also click edit and I can rename this. So Google Sheets. I'll keep it like that. And save it. And if you want to see all your credentials, you can go back to your main page. And then go to credentials. So that's how to set it up. When you set up your Google Sheets, a lot of nodes are going to want to use Google Drive as well. So I recommend just adding Google Drive to this project. So what you can do, is go back to the Google Cloud, you're still in this project, APIs, enable, and then also just enable the drive. 
and do the same steps. I'll have a separate video on setting up Google Drive API 